1917 Rose Bowl, but that was the last time and the only time the Oregon Ducks have won this game. Jim, what does this victory represent for the program? You know, for all of our fans out there, it's been 95 years since you could say Oregon Ducks, Rose Bowl champions. And it's about this. Let's get that away. You guys had to fight for four quarters, just as you have in a couple of big stages in recent years. What to you made the difference down the stretch? I think these kids just believe they have a faith in each other, that it's always going to work out for them, and it's based on their preparation. They buy into everything. Our coaching staff and our players get along so well. There's a great chemistry between all of us because we love and respect each other. We we'll talked to the two MVPs, one of them, the defensive MVP, Kiko Alonso, a guy who's had an interesting journey here, had to overcome a lot, his own mistakes and some bad luck. What does this represent to you as his coach the night he had this? Yeah, I, I get welled up about that, but I love Kiko, and I told him it wasn't about his interception, but what he's done and how he's come back is what this deal's all about. He's an outstanding young man. I love the kid. Chip, congratulations. Let's speak now to the defensive player of the game. You're back here in your home state. We talked about your journey here, which has been, you know, some bad luck's been part of it. Your mistakes have been part of it. What does this represent to persevere and have this game? Man, it feels great. Uh, it's been a long run. We've been doing this since, since January, and we knew that we had to we had to go all the way, all four courts. And it feels great. Your interception set up the game-winning points. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Let's bring in Lavasier to A couple of touchdowns. Your final game was an Oregon Duck. What does this represent to you? Man, uh, it's, it's a great feeling. I mean, we, we worked hard to get to this point. And when we had the opportunity to, you know, come out like this, everyone stepped up and we won. Congratulations to the Ducks. Brent, back to you. All right, and up next on ESPN, the Tostitos Fiesta Bowl. This has been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports, along with Kirk Herbstreit and Aaron Andrews and our...